Piatron was founded to develop collision avoidance devices using computers to aid ships in avoiding collisions while reducing the manpower required to interpret radars. The approach that was used to take the space age engineers that had been working on corona satellites for the CIA uh, to essentially do what a man does when he plots manually. That is, he views a plan position indicator, a PPI scope, uh, which shows the display of land and dots showing ship-sized objects or buoys or perhaps even uh, uh, small islands. Uh, what he does is pick and choose the ones that he wants to plot manually. Uh, what we have done is essentially a very sophisticated hardware software process that took over a million dollars in almost two years that essentially uh, very simply does what the man does and it's similar to a technique where you want to pick the fly specks out of the pepper. When this was introduced to a New York Times observer, uh, he took a ride on our test vessel in Long Island Sound, seeing it actually work. Uh, with this description, he was able to write an article about a new radar raid helping ships avoid collisions. Uh, you can see uh, a picture of the radar and a picture of Digiplot next to it. Having uh, extracted the ship size echoes, he did the very precise calculations using modern computer technology to plot courses and speeds, true plots. You can see up to 40 vessels and buoys shown leaving Boston Harbor. Uh, later, nearly 550 of these were built for $41 million, and an additional $3 million was spent in perfecting it with other accessories, including uh, uh, navigation devices, uh, supplementing satellites using Loran, and also a fuel-saving autopilot, which is now becoming a need to save the uh, planet from uh, climate control or excessive carbon, reducing the carbon footprint while making ship owners more profitable.